Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will show how to make fast food social media post animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, vectors from freepy.com. After finished video, I will share project files and download links. So first, let's select this food one and go to solo. Then go to here, let's enable title action save and move to center this object and let's press P, make new passing tree frame and move to down. Then go to 10 k frame, let's click here, write plus 10 for go to 10 k frames, click OK and let's move to up. Go to again 10 k frame. Let's move to down. Again, go to 10k frame. Move to up. And again, move to down. And again, go 10k frame. Move to up. So, there's more keyframes for bones animation. Let's select keyframes and make easy ease or click F9. Let's animation. Nice. Let's select all keyframes and right mouse. Go to keyframe interpolation. Change auto bezier to linear. Click OK. Let's see. Okay, not bad. So in this time, select this foot and let's go to first second. Hold shift, press air for open rotation. Make rotation keyframe, chain rotation minus six, and go to ten keyframe, chain three. Go to again ten keyframe, change minus one. Again, go ten keyframe, change zero. Select keyframes, make again easy. Let's see. Okay, not bad. So in this time, let's unsolo layer and select this red and red elements, make composition, click precoms, add name red, click OK. Back to composition and let's see. OK, nice. Let's open composition and select these red elements. Let's go to first second, press T for open opacity and I will make like this opacity animations let's make opacity keyframe and change zero go to six keyframe let's click here write plus six click ok and change 100 go to again six keyframe click ok and change zero let's see okay say keyframes make easy and go to first second let's hold alt click this time icon Go to play button, property, and let's use loop duration expression. For down this expression, click this empty area. Let's see. Okay, nice. Let's close red composition. Let's see. Nice. And select this text one. Let's link to food one. Let's see. Okay, let's go to here. Press S, change scale zero. And make sketch frame, go to 10 key frame, change scale 110, go to again 10 key frame, change 95, again go to 10 key frame, change 105, again go 10 key frame, change 100. Select key frames and make easy. Let's see. Nice. So, let's select these key frames and move to left. Then select this text layer. Let's move to right. Let's move to left like this. Okay, nice. So in this time, let's select this foot two. Let's enable. Okay, and move to up. And let's move to here. Layer. And press P. Let's move to right. Okay, make new passing keyframe and go to five keyframes and move to here like this. Then select these keyframes, make easy and let's select work area. Okay, go to solo, go to graph editor and select this graph. Let's make smooth. Okay, like this. 
back to keyframe, select this last keyframe, move to right. Okay, not bad. Move to right again, a little bit. Okay, let's unsolo. And let's select this yellow background, let's enable. Okay, and yellow elements. Let's select these two layers, right mouse, precoms, and name yellow. Click OK. Let's back to here. And select this yellow background, let's move to right. Okay, and let's open conversation. Then, let's go to shape layers, hold this icon and select this rectangle tool. And let's make rectangle like this. Click session tool and go to fill. Select this eyedropper. Select this color for line. Okay, click OK. And let's select these yellow elements. Let's delete. Change the shape layer name elements. Okay, and in this time go to add and let's use repeater. Open repeater one and change copies. Let's select first element, move to left. Okay, change copies 10. Let's change like this. Okay, nice. So, in this time, let's change these copies 50. Okay, so select these elements and press R. Chain rotation like this. Let's change 45 and move to here. Then, let's change scale like this for full screen. Okay, let's select these elements, open inside and open here. Let's make new passing keyframe and go to 8 second. And let's move to left like this. And move to up. Okay, we can use mouse for this. Let's see. Nice. So, let's back to fast food. Let's see here. Okay, and let's select this yellow. Let's press P, make new passing keyframe and move to right this background. Then go to here and let's move to left. We can use this line for center. Okay. Select keyframes, make easies, go to graph editor and let's make smooth graph. Okay, back to keyframes and select this last keyframe for foot 2 and let's move to right like this. Okay, so let's select this foot 1 and let's press P, go to here, make new passing keyframe and go to last keyframe and move to left then go to back here hold shift press s for open scale make scale keyframe and go to last keyframe chain scale like this and move right a little bit okay select the scale keyframes make easies then select these four keyframes for position and for scale go to graph editor and let's make graph select this Last keyframes, move to left, select first keyframes, move to right a little bit. Let's see. Okay, very nice. So back to keyframes and in this time, let's go to pen tool and let's make one line like this. Click session tool and go to fill, click here. Select none for close inside color, click OK. Go to stroke width, change stroke width like this. Go to color, change to black, click OK. Let's see, OK, nice. And select the shape layer, change name line. And move to right. Then go to add, let's use team pads. Open team pads here. Change end zero make end keyframe and go to some keyframes change end 100 
Select keyframes, make easies. And go to graph editor. Let's make graph like this. Let's see. Okay, back to keyframes. Select last keyframe, move to right. And in this time, let's move to here. Okay, let's select this line and link to yellow background composition. Let's see. Nice, let's move to left. Okay, that's good. So, let's select this text and select scale keyframes, control C and close inside and foot to close. Select this text tool, let's enable and let's move to here, move to up. Okay, and let's move to right this layer and press S, Control V, paste keyframes. Let's see. Nice. And let's link to this foot too. Move to left. Let's see. Nice. So in this time, let's add other products. Select this blue, let's enable layers. And select blue elements, right mouse, precoms, add the name blue. Click OK. And back to yellow, select these yellow elements, Control C, back to blue. And let's go to here, Control V. Okay, then go to fill color, select eyedropper, select this background yellow color. Click OK. Select these blue elements, delete. Let's see. Nice. And back to fast food. Okay, select this blue background. Let's move to right. Okay, right now, let's press P and move to right and move to up. Okay, and move to down. Let's again see here, center line. And move to here. And move to left for this line, like this. Okay, nice. So, select this blue and move to behind the line like this. And select this blue, let's make new passing keyframe and move to right. Then, move to down. Select this passing keyframes, make easies. Go to graph editor, select these graphs. Let's make smooth, let's see. Nice, back to keyframes and select this blue background. Let's move right a little bit. Okay, good timing. And select this line. Let's control D and press R. Change rotation 90. Then press P and move to right this layer. Let's see. Let's press R. Chain rotation like this, minus 90, and press P, move to right, and move to down. Then select this line 2 and let's link to blue. Okay, let's see. Move to left. Nice. So select this foot 2, let's press P. Make new passing keyframe, go to here and move to up. Let's hold shift press S, go to back, make scale keyframe, go to last keyframe, chain scale like this and move to down. Okay, select the scale keyframes, make easies. And select these four keyframes, go to graph editor and let's select this graph. All right, let's see. Okay, not bad. Select the scale keyframes. Let's make like this.
Okay, very nice. Okay, back to chair frames. And in this time, let's enable full tree. Let's enable here and move up. And press S, chain scale. Move up. Okay, and move right this layer. Let's press P, make new passing keyframe, move to down, and go to here, move to up. Select these keyframes, make easies, go to graph editor, select this graph, make smooth animation, select last keyframe, move to right. Let's see. Okay, and let's select this full tree, move to left. Move to left a little bit again. Okay, very nice. And select this text tree, let's enable and move to up. Press S, change scale here. And select this text two, press S, select this sketch frames, control C, and select this text, control V. And cut layers like this. We want to change this scale size. Let's go to layer, new and null object, select this text tree, link to null, select null, press S, change scale, move to here and delete null and select this text tree let's link to full tree and move to left okay let's see okay very good let's see full animation nice so thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck